Hey, what's up Vogue? It's Lauren London and I am here to show you my When I Care skincare routine and a little light beat. This is a cleanser that I use. A black woman owns this company and it's non-toxic. The back says, I like my products how I like my people. Non-toxic. I've always been very serious about washing my face. I feel like when I was in high school, I learned the really harsh lesson of going to bed without washing my face and I had a really bad breakout on my forehead. So I do some toner, which is also all natural. I have sensitive skin, so I try not to do too much of me, a lot of harsh chemicals. Live it in like this. <sighs> you can do some deep breathing, get your mind right. One of my favorite products. Also a woman owns this, a woman of color. Purple and Prosper Calm Complexion Serum. Growing up, I don't remember any black owned skin products around our household. And I feel like now it's more available. It's out there. It's skin products that actually understand what's going on with my skin. They're a body for my face and I use the red light. Red light is really good for like the rejuvenation of your cells and fine lines because this is not 22 anymore. My handy dandy Lemire. I've been using Lemire since I was 21. This is a soft cream, so you don't have to like make it warm and then pat it. This is also good for like being on the go. I don't have time to be doing all of that, patting her down. Honey, it is giving moisturized skin and go down to the neck. I'm gonna add this under eye brightening turmeric eye cream, a little dab like that. I don't always have time to do this routine because especially in the morning when I have to rush to take the kids to school. If I have some time and I do want to like take time with myself and be intentional about my face and you know, this is also very therapeutic. I'll do all this. If I don't have time, it's giving face wash and a moisturizer. When I do have time, I'm very big with meditation, reading, I love to read. I love writing, being in the room and listening to music. Music is like a really big form of medicine for me. I'm a really big uh, 90s R&B adult contemporary fan. <laughs> I'm also, I'm, I'm a big jazz fan, Layla Hathaway, Anita Baker, Rochelle Farrell, Kim. You know, things that like just kind of bring down my nervous system because I'm naturally um, very anxious. I love the Tatcha uh, lip mask. I usually use this Laura Mercier tinted moisturizer. So I rub it in like this. Growing up, Rite Aid or CVS would be where I would buy my makeup. And um, it was really hard finding a color that matched my skin complexion. And I feel like you would have to mix and match. And I just am not good at that. And I think as times have changed and makeup has become more inclusive, I hope everyone can find their shade in that. I have really, really dark circles um, because I don't get enough sleep. <laughs> I have two kids. <laughs> So I use this Tom Ford uh, color correcting pen under my eyes before I go in with concealer. People always ask me like, how do I manage being a working mom? Honestly, my kids come first. Had a really rough couple years. So their emotional wellness and well-being is my priority. And then, you know, I take jobs that respect me as a mother and honor my time as a mother. Armani Luminous Concealer in a lighter shade than the other one. I'm gonna mix these two today because I feel like the sun's been shining a little bit. You can just put it on your hand like this. Not too much, you don't want people to think you're doing too much in the middle of the day. Or maybe you do, maybe you don't care. 
Live your life. Who cares what people think? Okay, bow. Hit it up like this. Okay, bow, 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 bow. These little eyebrows right here need a little love in the club. I just be talking and saying stuff. I'm my only child, so I talk to myself a lot, all the time. I am my own best friend. I'm gonna bake this up because I get creased up under here. I don't know why. That's how the Lord made me, okay? Tatcha uh, the silk powder. Now I'm gonna go into some bronzer. This cute Chanel bronzer. Swirl her around like this. And I heard Miss J Lo say that go up under here because that's where the light, something like that. So Miss J Lo says something, I'm gonna keep. Okay, bow, wow, wow. Yippee yo, yippee yay. I like to keep my eyebrows kind of thick. And anybody who knows me knows I don't touch this. In high school, <laughs> my eyebrows were as thin as this black string, okay? And I had slits. Then I would like tweeze two little slits, which I really do like that look. I might go back to the slits. I don't use anything on my eyebrows besides uh, Anastasia, her dip brow. When I get makeup done professionally, I don't let anyone do my eyebrows. Like they can do anything else. My eyebrows are mine. So on this new movie, You People, I actually got the honor to work with one of my beauty icons, Nia Long. She's a professional, uh, the way she carried herself as a black woman on a set. And she's so pretty. In, on pictures and much more beautiful in person. Like I just, her face card does not mine. I'm in love with this liquid uh, kilowatt. I just put a little bit right there. Pat it with this beauty blender. I'm going to now get into my blush, which is NARS Torrid. You can do a little smile. Oh, looks like I'm blushing. <laughs> Lancome Hypnose Drama is to me the best mascara in the world. I'm just gonna say it. Look at that. Mm. I love me some Fenty Beauty Clear Lip Gloss. My dad told me this advice one time because I was going on auditions and I was, it's like rejection after rejection. And he was like, you know, every no you get is just one step closer to your yes. So then I would rejoice in the no's because I would be like, oh, that means it's getting closer to the yes. Now that we're done with all of this, we're gonna set it with this, I gotta cover my little edges, so. This was a lot of fun, thank y'all.